Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are we doing? It's Big P here, you know don't you, you know. What's Eddie Hearn doing for Billy Joe Saunders, Callum Smith, John Ryder, what's happening with them boys, Josh Warrington, where, 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 where are we going here with this? Where are we going with these lads here, why are they not getting on these shows? What's, what's happening here? I don't know, I just, uh, they must, these lads must be thinking, oh my god, there's another pay-per-view slot going out to Dylan White. Dylan White's getting his sixth pay-per-view in two more months. But these lads here, they're not, they're not getting looked after, are they? They're not eating at the same table as Dylan White, are they? Everybody's eating except Josh Warrington, undefeated. Callum Smith, undefeated. Billy Joe Saunders, undefeated. Free world champions there, all of them not eating. And John Ryder were robbed in his fight against Callum Smith. These guys here are not eating. Why is that? But yet Dylan White's eating again. He's out in his sixth pay-per-view. I mean, what is going on here? What? I don't get this, me. What, what has Dylan White got on Eddie Hearn? Is Eddie scared to death of him? Why? Is he scared to death of the, the fraud, fraudulent guy who's his brother? Dean White, Dean Povetkin, Dean Fury, Lemur Scott, Gappy Dean, whatever they want to call him. Guy's a fraud. It's not his name. If your name's Dean White, Dean White, show me your passport or your driving license because you know it's not true. Isn't that right? You know, you know. But he's playing a game in it. But this is how I look at it, right? This is how I look at it. There's talkers and there's smoky bacon walkers and there's prostitutes, right? There's prostitutes and. The levels that people are going to prostitute themselves in boxing now is out of control. Brasses. Brasses. It's it's unbelievable. It's I mean we even had Dave Allen coming out of a night one he saying that he didn't want Danny Williams to fight again, that every fight he has from now on is gonna give Danny Williams a cut of his purse. Well you've said it now, Dave, so I wanna see a check on Instagram, you handing a check from your fights, every fight to Danny Williams. Because if you don't, why would you have said that? Is it just because you want to jump on the moment and make yourself look good on social media? Because, like I said, there's a lot of people done that recently, haven't there? Handing millions out to charities, but you pull them about it and they don't want to talk about it. People say things because they get caught up in the moment. Personally, Dave Allen won't give Danny Williams a bean. He won't give him a baked bean, right? If he does, I'll tip my hat to you. Speaking of hats, Marcus, don't send me any more t-shirts because you're starting to send me the same colours, unless they're different designs. Send me an hat, a couple of hats or something. Alright, so just, just thought I'd get that in. Uh, I think that's about it really. So we've, we've covered that, haven't we? We've covered it, but like I said, I just hope that all them fighters get out there and get dates because... When you've got three undefeated world champions and they're not getting out, I think it's shocking. I think it's shocking. And I want to see Ryder Callum Smith or... I want to see Billy Joe against Ryder. I want to see you back in mix. I mean, his sister's getting married to Spotty, isn't she? Frank Spotty Face Smith, who makes Eddie Earns tea. Aren't they getting married or something? Old Spotify, Oxy10, isn't he getting married? And can't Chris Eubank tell his sister to get Eddie to get him on a show or something? I mean, what's going on here? I want to see Saunders Eubank too. I want to see Saunders Ryder. I mean, is Billy Joe switched on enough at the moment or is his head not right? I don't know what, what's going on here. I mean, and has he got managers coming up? I mean, he's not fighting anybody, is he? What, has Billy just gone home from camp in Portugal? In, not Portugal, he's in Fiorentina. He's just flown back, hasn't he? So, I don't know, that's what I'm hearing, so. If Billy's back in UK, he's not in camp, what, what's going on? Are they trying to get him to fight Callum Smith? Don't he want to fight Callum Smith? Is that why he's come home? The Canelo fight and Golovkin, they're gone, aren't they? But Billy's a five-year world champion, but six fights in five years, not good, is it? I don't think. So, that's how I look at it, but I want, I want to see Billy Joe Saunders back at middleweight. I think he's best middleweight out there. Him and, him and Canelo at middleweight is a good fight. I think Canelo struggles at that weight. He'd have to take weight off, wouldn't he? But could Billy Joe Saunders be the biggest waste of talent ever as a middleweight? Yeah. 
but it is what it is isn't, isn't it so peace out keep on trucking keep sporting boxing thanks for liking and subscribing and sharing the video and leaving a comment it means a lot to me all right thank you